Hello, my name is Jerzy Szymonek and I'm from the company CFD Support. And now I would like to show you how to run the pump tutorial case in the Turbo Machinery CFD software. To start Turbo Machinery CFD software, just double click on TCFD icon on your desktop or write TCFD, all capitals, to the terminal and press enter. The TCFD graphical user interface opens. And the next step will be to load the preset tutorial case. To do it, just click on the load button here and select the appropriate TCFD file and load it. In our case, it's the radial pump.tcfd. Now we can see the path to the loaded setup file in the setup file entry. And all the following case setup has been preset according to the loaded TCFD file. To fully activate the case, click on the apply button. The case is active now and when you would like for example to show the geometry of the pump we are going to simulate, just click on the eye icon next to the components in the pipeline browser. So this is our geometry of the radial pump we are going to simulate. This is the inlet pipe, the impeller component and the, the volute component. You can now check the case setup and you can of course possibly change some setup parameters. The simulation will be steady state on six CPUs, the numerical order, the, the order of the schemes will be the first order. The simulation will be performed with a fluid defined as water. Here you can check and finish your case setup. Once we finish editing case setup parameters, we can move on for running the simulation. Please don't forget to click apply whenever you change anything. Now click on settings and this icon will be activated. And now click on this icon and the TCFD manager will be opened. The TCFD manager is for running and controlling the simulation. Click apply to activate it. Enter here the directory name, for example, pump test one and click apply. Now click on write case and the case will be written to disk. Here you can see the output and here you can of course check if everything was properly written to the disk. Write case done. So everything seems fine. And now we have several options how to continue. We can click on run all to run the whole CFD process at once, like meshing, running the simulation and automatic evaluation of simulation results. Or we can go step by step by creating the mesh. The mesh can be created at once as well or uh, separately component by component. Then we can run the calculation and then we can generate the, the report to evaluate the results. There are two options, one light report just for simple plots of the main variables or the, the full report which takes much more time to generate but it contains all the necessary data for the turbo machinery design. Let's click on run all for now to run the whole CFD process at once. Automatic mesh generation, running the CFD simulation and the automatic evaluation of the results. So the TCFD manager starts the mesh generation and here you can watch the progress. It starts with component one. Now the component one is already meshed and the component two is in progress. Now the mesh is generated and TCFD manager starts the calculation. Here we can watch in which iteration we are currently 
and estimated time in which the simulation will be finished. And now the simulation is finished. There was also generated the report with the results that we can display in this window and go through them. There are simulation statistics with the residuals, the convergence, pump head and its convergence, pump efficiency and its convergence, torque of the impeller and its convergence as well. And in the end of the report, there is also the graphical output, the graphical results, there is a blade to blade view in selected spans colored by selected variables. And also there are meridionally averaged variables which are also useful in rotating machinery design. And that's all. All the simulation data are saved automatically in the case directory pump test one and you can easily load them again into the pair view when it is necessary. So thank you for watching this video.